Secretary to the Government of the Federation, SGF, Boss Mustafa, has said that failure by many Nigerians to believe in the existence of coronavirus posed a great challenge to the fight against the pandemic by the Presidential Task Force on COVID-19. Mustafa, who expressed the dismay over the low level of compliance with the rules of engagement put in place by the government to tackle the pandemic, noted that many Nigerians have continued to flout the directives to observe social distancing, wear face masks, use hand sanitizers and subject themselves to temperature testing, while some even say the pandemic is a hoax. Represented by the Permanent Secretary, Adekunle Olushegun, the SGF urged Nigerians to protect themselves and others from being infected by observing all government and health authorities' laid-down protocols. We go to Kano State, where the government has cancelled all traditional Salah festivities to celebrate the Eid al-Kabir in the state. The Commissioner for Information, Mohamed Gadaba, says the decision was reached by the state's executive council as part of its efforts to consolidate and current gains made in the management of the coronavirus pandemic. Gadaba, however, says Muslim faithful are permitted to attend congregational prayer but under strict supervision by government officials. As part of efforts of the state government, to consolidate on the success it so far achieved in the fight against COVID-19 and the relaxation of lockdown in many states of the Federation. Kano State Executive Council, after due deliberation, orders and endorsed the cancellation of traditional Salah festivity to celebrate the Eid al-Kabir in the state. All festivity as far as the issue of Salah, just like what was observed in the last Eid al-Fitr, has been endorsed and counseled by the State Executive Council. However, the Council grants approval for the conduct of Eid congregational prayers across the state under the strict observance of safety protocol which are to be supervised by government officials.